Use AP Invoice Entry to enter purchase assets. To do this, create an asset detail line. The application does not consider the asset as a part. Instead, the asset is a purchased item. To enter an asset line, you should have an invoice group and invoice set up. If you already have the invoice group and invoice created, select the invoice where you want to enter an asset. If not, create an invoice group by selecting New Group. The Group Info panel displays. Enter the group ID and apply date of the group and select Save. Now to create a new invoice, select the New Invoice button on the Invoices card. In the Invoice Detail card, enter the necessary information like the supplier, invoice number, invoice date, terms, and amount, and then select Save. Go to the nav tree. Expand the invoice lines and select the detail node. Expand the overflow menu and select new asset line. In the details card, scroll down to the invoice information section. Go to the description field and describe the asset. Next, select a tax category. Tax categories divide taxes into groups that apply to different products and items. Go to Supplier Quantity and enter how many asset items you purchased. Now specify the unit cost. This value defines how much each unit of the asset is worth. Select Save.